My name is Yanni, I am the co-creator of this OBD2 telemetry system, and what this system allows you to do is log real-time data about your car, such as your MPG, your RPM, or even your fuel percentage. Um, so what I have here is a two-part device. This first part it plugs into the OBD2 port of your car and talks via Bluetooth to this main module. This main module um, will sit up on your dash and has an STM32 processor, which will process the data and display um, the information on this LCD. And so this uh, system we have here is highly customizable and easily flexible to meet the needs of any car enthusiast. Um, for example, we have an application here that will allow you to log your 0 to 60 time. Um, and to demonstrate this, we're going to show you the uh, device working in real time. Hi, I'm Tony, the other co-creator of this OBD2 telemetry system. And I'm going to walk you through the basic functionality of the system itself. So the first part is we have to plug in the OBD2 connector to the OBD2 port of our car. This connector is going to talk via Bluetooth to the main module that sits up on the dash. Once the main module is powered, we'll be presented with a screen in order to calibrate the touchscreen panel. Upon successful calibration of the screen, we'll be, we'll be presented with a main and initialization screen which shows us everything being set up. We'll then be presented with our home screen which is a representation of all the commands being sent to and received from the car. We display all this data in, inside several tiles. The commands that we're currently sending to the car are for the engine RPM, the fuel percentage left in your car, the current miles per gallon for the way that you're driving, and the current engine temperature. All of this data is being logged in real time several times a second. Now in the upper right hand corner we have a button to launch an application for the user to log their 0 to 60 time. Once you select this button, you will be presented with a new screen in order to confirm your choice. If you select no, you do not want to log a 0 to 60 time. You will be brought back to the home screen and the telemetry data will continue to log. However, if you select yes, you will be brought to a new screen which will log your current vehicle speed and the time. Now on this screen, your car is constantly being pulled to determine when your car starts to move. Once your car starts to move, the vehicle speed and time will be logged on screen. Once your vehicle speed reaches 60 miles per hour, the application will close. You'll then be presented with your final 0 to 60 time. You can then select a home button, which will bring you back to the home screen to continue logging your telemetry data. So that was just the basic functionality of our system, but it could be easily extended to suit the need for any application.